I, this so, whole area to me is like okay. anything that you would stick in the oven, figure it out first, and then okay. when we have extra space, that's when we can put like, because like I think this makes more sense to put the casserole bags here. Probably. Okay, it's over there. Like, I've already told you I want that one for vases because I do put like I prepare that stuff in the kitchen. I have no idea what we're doing there. Um, hot, the, what do you call it? We'll get like an actual real set of hot plates and oven mitts. Spices and all more like for the run. I mean, they can. Oh, you're I'm so right. Like, so, spices there, silverware there. Or silverware so going in the big drawer or are they going in the small drawer? Small, like that one. Not this. I think so. I, I think we have enough. We'll only use one drawer. You also do cups and stuff closer to the fridge because your drinks are actually going to be over here. Like Hello, happy, it's actually Saturday when we're filming this, the 20, whatever, 5th, yep. and we are two weeks away from our son's first birthday. Two weeks. I am not ready. We did not have any real plans this weekend. I ended up getting, um, last minute, I ordered some, like, time capsule thing for his, let me put my arm down over there, um, so that we're going to have people, like, basically write you know, either their favorite memory, a piece of advice or something. And then this, I got this pretty wood box from Etsy. I'll link it below. Um, and it's, we're gonna put all that stuff in there and it like says on there his 20, his 18th birthday will be April 8th, 2040, which is insane. And um, we can open it then. So I got that stuff that's done this morning. And then um, clip you guys saw, we went to the house. I, every time I go there, try to analyze what the heck we're gonna do with that kitchen. And then, um, the tub actually came, so we ended up, Sam helped my dad move that in. And I did not get to see it, but, I mean, it's a tub. I trust that it looks really good. It's not, I mean, it's still in the box in the bedroom, so. Until they, oh, it's in the bedroom? Well, yeah, until they fully finish the shower, it's not even gonna uh, okay. go, yeah. Um, but we are back, on our way back to the Dagum store. We, I just went yesterday and forgot, there was like a couple things that Sam, like he didn't, he never adds anything to the grocery list, even though I always tell him, out you gotta add it and so I think we have to get like milk and I saw this yummy recipe on TikTok which actually that would be the only reason that I would say I thought about that that would be the only thing I was really sad about if TikTok went away is the loss of recipes I love all the recipes I saw it's like a high protein low calorie like crunch wrap basically and this girl puts all the normal ingredients on it that you would like make a crunch wrap with, like you would get a crunch, crunch wrap from Taco Bell. But she uses like the Quest protein chips. Is that what that brand is? Um, she uses those. And I was like, that sounds so good to me. So I feel like maybe we'll do those for dinner tomorrow. Um, and then we can probably just get Sam like regular Dorito chips. But we're also gonna get some stuff to make those chicken flatbreads again that I shared, I think maybe not the last vlog, but the vlog before. Um, so yummy. And that's what I think we're gonna do for dinner tonight. And Sam's gonna do the buffalo chicken one that my mom told him about. So, ended up kind of being a relatively busy day. Not like as chill as I thought, but I, um, you know, definitely forgot to get some stuff at the store yesterday. We absolutely need it. Like Drano, we need. Sam's been complaining about ranch. We need milk. All kinds of stuff. Tree haul. Real quick. This house is still a mess. And we've cleaned it since last night. We got these yummy things. Sam and I can never resist all of the grocery store desserts. So I got the... What are you laughing at, silly boy? Do you see the camera? I got cookies and cream. Little like... It's like a little brownie. Almost. It just says Oreo cake spoon dessert. It's like for one person, and then Sam got Reese's. Okay, that actually doesn't look terrible. Probably put them in the fridge. Though. Yeah, we can share this. Okay. No. <laughs> you said no. Own it. Own okay. your mistakes. All right. Milk. Your actions have consequences. Oh, shut up. Drano. Need a Drano. And then this is actually, so I got, I've seen so many recipes, and I think I mentioned it in the car. Like tortilla uh, shell, a little bit of queso, or like this kind of queso. It's the salsa con queso made with real cheese. You're putting them down for a nap? I'm to. Oh, good luck. Oh, I guess it is 3.30. But it's this, um, this kind of queso, and it's 45 calories for two tablespoons, which is when you are actually like thinking about how 
much queso is needed on something like that. That's a lot, like two tablespoons is plenty. So um, that, and then you do like, you know, ground beef, lettuce, sour cream, all that stuff. Sam got ranch dressing with bacon, which is gross to me. Um, not real ranch. And then he cut fruity pebbles. Literally we spent $68 on grocery store and this is like children's food. Like my husband, this is why I don't go grocery shopping with him. Ezra's crying, I don't think he's gonna nap long. More milk. Oh, he's getting his diaper changed. Last three things. So these are what the girl uses. Oh, these are Atkins. They were with all the Quest stuff. Um, they'll be a fine, but this is what you put in the um, in the actual like crunch wrap. Is you put protein chips, and the girl used Quest, but these are Atkins. But they're like protein chips. Got ranch. We're making the flatbread again tonight for dinner. So we got the, it smells so good, the garlic kind. Sam got cranberry juice. He's been craving cranberry juice. This is why you never grocery shopping with my husband. Take a little siesta. Got more tortilla shells for me. I like the carb kind of ones. And then Sam got these oatmeal raisin cookies. Ugh. Two packs of them because they had to buy one, get one free. I don't think the snap's gonna go well, babe. We got some Sweet Baby Rays because they did not have the big bottle of Sweet Baby Rays in the buffalo wing sauce. They had like a couple other kinds, so we had to get four of these because he's doing a buffalo chicken flatbread tonight. And then toothpaste, and that was it. Very boring, but look, this is like junk, Sam. You got junk. How's it doing? Good job. I'll be dying. He's actually gonna go down. All right. All right. So it took like five minutes. We made the same flatbread we made a couple, a couple, is it cold? It's cold, buddy. Um, Sam made some kind of weird one. He put, what'd you put on yours, baby? Flatbread. I got, I got a buffalo chicken the, one. This was the buffalo wing sauce. And then he did a little bit of honey barbecue, barbecue on one. one. Yeah, Chicken and then cheddar cheese. Mine is the same flatbread. It's like a garlic flatbread. Um, Caesar dressing, this one, so so good. And then, uh, look at them. Look how cute they are. He's so cute. Um, and then spinach and a little bit of feta. And this is the one that I did. I find that like more often than not, um, at least me, our store's around here have is it pasteurized whichever one you can have pregnant pasteurized and i think it's pasteurized yes okay so pasteurized i find that around here like i there's no unfat unpasteurized feta unless you go to like some kind of market and get it from someone else like but i find that just all of these but i have people always freak out and they're like you're not supposed to have feta while you're pregnant and i'm like oh, it's pasteurized right yeah i can have that <laughs> i always like second guess myself Ooh, i want to show them this tree outside what did mom and dad say this tree was it's a, um, it's a cherry tree it's a cherry tree? Yeah, like that has a little red wood. Yeah, this tree is a monster. She gives me the worst allergies, but I legit want to like dig this thing up and take it with us. We're gonna actually plant one in our new house. Like the base of it is not even near as pretty as it used to be, but like, look at this. Is that not the most beautiful thing you have ever seen? And I don't know why, but my allergies absolutely cannot handle this thing. I mean, like, look at that. How gorgeous are all of these? So uh, we are gonna be planting this at the new house. One like this, I guess. And we're gonna actually take care of it. Oh, you guys. I am going back to the store again for the third day in a row. We keep, so I'm actually gonna blame Sam for part of this and the other two things are just like convenience. If I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna grab everything kind of situation. So yesterday we were at the store. I said, we need sour cream. 
Tim. So we have sour cream. I said, if we have sour cream, it's expired because I didn't know we have sour cream and I know what's in my fridge and I hate when things are expired in my fridge. But every day, my makeup looks awful. I used a new foundation today. Ugh, will not be using it ever again. Literally, I have all these like, my skin's just really, really red during pregnancy. It's not acne over here. It's just like red. Uh, and you can literally see all of it. So, um, I told him, I said, we need sour cream. If we, ha if we have sour cream in the kitchen, in the fridge, it is expired. And I hate expired things. So I would know that and it wouldn't be in my fridge. He said, I promise it's in there. We just got it. Expired February 25th. So <laughs> I have to go back because we absolutely need it for tonight's dinner. I've been talking about tonight's dinner for so long. It's this like crunch wrap thing that I found on Pinterest. It's like a crunch wrap recipe basically at home and it looks so good and I hope it's as good because I literally have like thought it up in my head for the past like week. I'm like, we should have that. And so now we have all the ingredients and we need the sour cream to make it authentic. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna go to the store. <laughs> And I am 20 weeks pregnant today. I look now like I looked when I was 30 weeks pregnant with Ezra. So this baby is big. And this week we have anatomy scan, which I'm so excited about. Um, I can't wait. Just had a vlog go live. I'm running all kinds of scatterbrained. But Ezra just went down for a nap. So I'm trying to run to the store in the meantime. Because on the weekends, I like to spend as much time with him as I like possibly can. <laughs> Ezra, Ezra, come here. You gotta walk to it though. Come on, you gotta walk to it. Put it down. No, you can't crawl. You gotta walk, silly. <laughs> you gonna go walk for me? You're not gonna show him that you've literally been walking all around the living room? You're not gonna show him? <laughs> You look so grubby. Ooh, he's been rubbing that thing all over the place. Don't bring the orange thing with you. <laughs> all right, let's make dinner. Okay. Come here. Come here, you sweet little baby. <laughs> Doing that. Made an absolute friggin' mess making these, but they look really good. Go see what, and look at this. This is what, honestly, so much of feeding a baby is. I'm interested to see what yours looks like on the inside. So you use chips as like the crunch. You want to get like a good. Let me see the finished product. It looks pretty good. Yeah, can you? Can't really see it, but looks really good. And then we have this extra salsa con queso and just regular salsa. These are chips, and that's oh my gosh.